सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट न्यू एंड कूल सीजीआई एंड वीएफएक्स एडवर्टाइजिंग बैनर एनिमेशन विदाउट यूजिंग एनी थर्ड पार्टी एड ऑन गाइस सी दैट्स माय रियली कूल एनिमेशन राइट गाइस दिस टाइम आई एम नॉट यूजिंग आफ्टर इफेक्ट एंड जियो ट्रैकर ऑन दिस ट्यूटोरियल सो नाउ गाइस आई टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ एनिमेशन इट्स रियली सिंपल एंड बेस्ट ट्यूटोरियल फॉर बिगिनर्स सो गाइस नाउ सेलेक्ट ऑल एंड प्रेस डिलीट की सो नेक्स्ट वन Go to on here VFX and motion tracking check yeah and this is my extra space so left join check and this time guys open guys import clip guys you can download this clip link in description and second one all project files from my website so guys I change firstly render setting so I like cycle render and device GPU check and SAM one two eight and go to on here film and transparent check so color and i like this time standard yeah right okay so now guys firstly this time click on here set screen frame check and next one refresh check so guys next step i create tracker points so detect feature check and go to on here guys i increase more points so threshold like a 0.1 and go to on here distance i like 80 yeah perfect so guys this time uh click on here it's my track marker check yeah it's my simple tracking okay so guys now you can delete this extra points so guys closer see guys that's my some extra tracker points so delete and delete this one and guys i create smooth tracker yes perfect okay so now next one go to on here and click all three option and solve camera motion check see okay, that's my solve error is 0.11 pixels it's good for me but guys you can create more smoothness so guys i show you how to create more smoothness so clean up and filter track yeah and see guys that's my threshold it's default 5 so i change like a 0.5 enter yeah it's my some extra points so delete yes and one more time solve camera motion check okay so guys same my solve error is 0.11 pixel is best for me and now guys this time my guys my tracking is finished so click on here set up background and set up tracking scene check yes but guys problem is that my video is vertical it's showing horizontal so change frame actually resolution like a 1080 and 1920 and guys frame rate same 29.97 fps so guys firstly this my scene so guys go to on here guys select only one point one center point like this so guys firstly click on here set origin check it's my center and now guys select three point like this simple select three point and guys it's my wall not flow so click on here wall check yes so guys that's my wall and now guys i change scale size scaling so select only two point two and set scale check and distance i like five enter yeah that's it guys okay so guys my tracking is finished so go to on here layout and press zero and guys play yeah it's my simple tracking guys my tracking is perfect okay so now next one stop so guys select all and press delete guys this time i take plane new plane and increase size like this and rotation change rotation like this yeah but guys problem is that my plane and guys my camera is not align on this building so guys create proportionate so align and see guys that's my alignment so guys go to on here and 3d cursor check so guys select this camera and in change position like a 90 and see guys that's my y axis minus 180 yeah perfect so z1 0 yeah this position is perfect for me 
and again same medium check point check yes right see guys that's my simple alignment and now guys this time i create animation banner animation it's my cloth so little bit change little bit and increase size so edit mode check select this one edge so go to down like this and guys more okay good and little bit more yeah this scene is good it's my cloth okay so now next one guys this time i take cylinder cylinder check and guys increase vertex like a 64 and radius like a 0.15 and guys i increase depth like a 11 and change rotation rotation like a 90 yes good and align like this and go to on top here yes perfect right see guys that's my cylinder and plane and guys overlapping yeah perfect okay so now guys this time i create vertex so edit mode select this edge and right click loop cut and slice check and enter and number of cut i like two yeah so guys select all press a shortcut command is a and right click subdivide it and subdivide it number guys like a 60 yes good see guys that's my simple vertex right and press camera yeah good okay so now next one guys this time uh guys i create vertex group so guys select plane and guys select this one bottom vertex holding control key and select like this see guys that's my simple selection select bottom vertex and go to on here and see guys that's my vertex group and plus icon check yes and assign check yeah that's it guys okay so now next one guys i apply this time building building rough layout i create building rough layout so guys i take cube and increase cube size cube size increase like this so guys little bit more more yeah and guys go to on back here so guys press 7 and go to on here like this more and align yes good so guys that's my cube and now guys go to on here and increase size so increase size like this more and align yeah good and now guys this time little bit increase size yes perfect yeah good okay so now guys this time it's my rough layout building rough layout so go to an edit mode select edge select this one press camera and go to on here like this and this edge go to on here yes perfect see so guys that's my rough layout and now we select edge select this one and this one go to on up like this yeah and this one see so guys that's my simple building okay all is good and now guys go to on here and object mode see guys that's my composition so and play see guys that's my really cool tracking so guys my tracking is perfect and now guys i create animation cloth banner animation rotate effect so go to on here guys this time go to on here edit mode and guys add on and type extra curve see guys that's my extra curve object check so go to on here curve and this time use archimedean check yes and now guys this time increase this time turn turn like a 8 and step guys i'll take like a 80 and guys see that's my radius increase so like a 0.0.15 
and radius 0.15 check yes see guys that's my simple shape right it's really simple so go to on object mode and go to on top here yes so press okay so guys go to on here mid and now guys rotate okay so guys rotation change like a this one 90 okay guys you can hide this cube hide and guys simple rotation change like this zero and rotation change okay to 70 and guys this position go to on here and again rotate yeah this rotation is perfect see see guys that's my rotation and go to on here so guys go to on mid okay see guys that's my mid yes perfect see guys that's my simple shape and now guys this time i apply this time oh guys curve tool so select this one and go to on here and curve check yes and curve object spiral the former axis i like minus y check yes good see guys that's my really simple shape right and guys select this one shape and plane and position change so press zero yeah in mid yes great okay so guys now next one uh guys little bit change position so press this time burn so guys select this one and go to on here and also guys select this plane and go to on here wireframe check guys you can change plane axis like this more yeah this shape is good see guys that's a plane okay so go to on here guys little bit change position and more guys little bit more yeah great right it's my simple position guys this edge inside cylinder right it's my last corner point plane last corner point okay go to on here wireframe see guys that's my last corner point in inside cylinder right okay so now guys this time i apply cloth effect so go to on here and cloth check firstly guys go to on here silk and tension i like three all three and three and blending i like zero so go to on down and see guys that's my shape so i like group right and go to on here collision and self collision check yeah that's it guys so press zero for camera and play okay but guys is turn reverse side so i change gravity so stop and go to on back go to on here guys see that's my gravity so gravity it's my z minus 9.81 so change minus to positive yeah and again go to back and play yes great see guys that's my cloth effect but guys take lots of time for preview so i create baking and smoothness so right click and smooth shadow check and go to on here so guys i apply subdivision surface here subdivision surface check and level i like two and two see guys that's my curve cloth and subdivision surface go to on last so guys for more smoothness increase quality i like eight is perfect for me more smoothness and go to on here quality see guys that's my quality i like five right five six is dependent on your system configuration but five is perfect so guys see that's my friction friction i like 0 0.5 friction 0 0.5 most important part friction 0 0.5 and also it's my cube see guys that's my cube and i apply collision effect and see guys that's my friction friction i like same 0 0.5 0 0.5 yeah great okay so guys again go to on here cloth and one more time check setting see guys that's my catch a last like a 700 and yeah group quality i like five so object okay yeah all is good 
Okay, so guys, now I quit baking. It take lots of time. So bake or dynamic check. Okay, so guys, my final baking is finished. And now guys, I show you my simulation. See guys, my simulation is perfect, right? See, guys, my cloth dynamics really perfect. And next one, guys, I apply this time light and texture. So guys, for texture, go to on here, shading mode. Yeah, see guys, that's my really cool effect. So select, go to on here, shading check. And guys, create new. So select this principal BSDF, press Ctrl T and apply texture. Guys, see that's my texture. Press zero, yeah, and go to on here layout. So, guys, this time I apply light, environment texture light. So, see guys, that's my environment light, and apply and strength one point five. Yes, and now go to on here render preview. Yes, so guys, select this one cube and go to on here. So visibility. And shadow catcher check yes that's it guys okay so guys my final work is finished it's my final close simulation effect and guys select this one cylinder and also guys I take this time dark color black yes okay so now guys this next one select the, your camera and go to on here and opacity 100% actually one check and also guys you can apply some objects so go to on here, file and append. Guys, I have air balloon 3D model like this. Select this one, collection check. Yeah. And guys, rotate. So click on here and rotate like this, like 180. And guys, go to on back here, this side. Yes. Okay, so guys go to on here like this and scale size change smaller. Yeah, perfect. Right and go to on this one. Select this one air balloon. So this side change position and increase size. Yes, great. Great. Okay, so now guys this time go to on back and select this empty object. So position, I will change. So check and last. So guys, increase, increase more. Yeah, like a minus 70 check. Yes, that's it guys. Okay, so now guys, that's it. My final work is finished. It's my final animation and really beautiful banner animation, right? So guys, that's it. My final work is finished. So go to on here and random color check it. That's it guys. Okay, so guys, that's it. My final work is finished. So guys, if you like my video, please share and please subscribe to my channel. And guys, you can download Project Pack from my website free. Thank you.